Hello my lovely Capricorns. How is everyone? I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So we are going to be doing your March weekly reading. It is a general reading so it may not be able to resonate for all of you and if you want something that is meant for your exact energy then I do a personals open and everything that you'll need to know will be in the description box below for you. So Archangels, spirit guides, and ancestors please deliver clear messages with a very clear understanding for my lovely, lovely Capricorns. Please, may the messages that need to be heard the very most please come through, and may they please find those who need to hear it. All right, Capricorn, let's take a look and see what we've got going on for you. The Three of Swords had fallen out when we were shuffling. We'll see if it finds its way back out. Put the Six of Swords in the reverse at the bottom of the deck for the, their general overall energy. So we're taking a look at the person that you're dealing with. Six of Swords in the reverse here. I do feel like they either feel like something is delayed. Now I see the Eight of Wands is here in the reverse. I also see the Knight of Swords is here in the reverse. So to me, it's like they're either waiting on some kind of communication or waiting for you to respond to their communication. Um, they could have been expecting something, some kind of message from you or some kind of communication from you, and they feel like it's delayed or it's taking too long, right? Maybe they expected that you guys would uh, already come back together, already be in communication, and you're not, and that they could feel like that's taking too long, like that's what's being delayed here. Now, the Six of Swords in the reverse can also talk or just about you know, having a hard time moving on from something, having a hard time moving past something here. And, you know, that could be them. They could be really struggling. I feel like you're definitely out of communication with this person at this time, and they're struggling to move past it. You have, I'm so attracted to you. Happy ending. And stringing you along. I'm trying to stay positive is at the bottom of the deck. With that stringing you along card, I feel like either you could have thought that they were just stringing you along. Um, We'll see. We'll see how that plays out. We're going to get your energy out here too. Now, we're going to do that and then we're going to start to clarify. But with this Eight of Pentacles, you have the Eight of Wands in the reverse for their thoughts. To me, that's, I feel like they're missing you. Like they want to, they want to communicate with you. They're missing you. And you know, the Eight of Wands can be a card of like precision and direction as well. So in the reverse, it's like, I feel like this person is just kind of like aimless. Like I don't, I don't even know what to do right now. Like, I'm, I miss talking to them. I want to talk to Capricorn. They're having a really hard time with this. They have the Nine of Swords here in their heart space. Like, they're very upset. Um, you know, can't sleep thinking about you. Your energy, Queen of Wands in the reverse. Three of Swords in the reverse. And the Eight of Wands for the general overall energy. And your cards are into you and driving me crazy. Regrets at the bottom of the deck. All right. So their intention is the strength card in the reverse. I almost feel like they're upset because I feel like they were expecting things to be a little bit harder on you. 
Um, as in, I don't feel like they want you to be upset or like they want you to be unhappy, but like they want to know that you're affected by this too. You know, they want to know that you're missing them too, that you're having a hard time too. You know, there's something like that here. The Knight of Swords in the reverse is the challenge. So to me, that is a, a sudden stop in communication and you could have been the one to stop communication with them, or there could be something that's, you know, preventing communication between the two of you. They could have you know, originally stopped communicating with you and now you are with them. I'm getting a lot of different messages, so just take it how it resonates for you. Um, their next step is the full card in the reverse. I feel like they're very anxious because I feel like they do want a happy ending with you. They are very attracted to you. They are very drawn to you. It's like they're having a hard time getting past this. They don't know what to do. Seven of Cups. You know, I do feel like they, um, yeah, I feel like they, uh, you know, they're just having a, hard, a really hard time moving past this and they want to talk to you. You know, they're, they're really struggling here. And they want to know that you're missing them too, that you're upset about them too. They have the, for the potential outcome is the Four of Pentacles, I feel like you're kind of standing your ground. You could be closed off to this person and they're still really holding on to things here. Now for you, you have the Queen of Wands in the reverse and the Three of Swords in the reverse. To me, the three of swords in the like, I feel like this person has hurt you in the past, okay? And maybe that's why that you felt like they were stringing you along is maybe they had a hard time with commitment or, you know, they could have, I just feel like this person has really hurt you in the past, okay? We're going to leave it at that. Um, it's going to resonate differently for all of you. They could have made you feel really bad about yourself, especially if there was like third parties and stuff like that, if they had inconsistent energies. Because the queen of wands in the reverse is also a card of insecurities. It's a card of, you know, a lack of confidence. And I feel like with this, I'm so attracted to you. Um, you know, I feel like they're trying to almost like reassure you because of the way that they treated you in the past you know maybe it did make you feel like you know you weren't good enough or you felt um like they weren't attracted to you like they could have you know i feel like stuff like that going on so i feel like there's this energy of like you know what i forgive you but i'm not sure that i'm willing to put myself back into that situation the three of swords in the reverse can talk about forgiveness it can talk about healing maybe you're still trying to heal from this you know you're still trying to heal from the effects of the past because with that into you card, I feel like you were really into this person and I feel like you really, you know, um, kind of gave them your all here and then, you know, they hurt you and it, it really uh, caused a lot of insecurities, a lot of self-doubts, a lot of lack of confidence for you here, Capricorn. And it's like, I'm not sure, I'm even if I forgive you, I'm not sure I'm going to open myself back up to that. And I feel like this is just this acceptance of, you know, the way that things are. You know, I feel like with this driving me crazy, I feel like this person has put you through a lot. Okay. Now there is going to be some communication coming in. You have the eight of wands here, but I'm not sure. Maybe they're, they've been trying to communicate with you and it's with the knight of swords in the reverse. Maybe you're not, you're have them blocked or you're choosing not to respond to them here. So let's start to clarify and see. Cause I feel like with this regrets, like you see that they're expressing that they have regrets, but you don't want to regret letting them back in. Tell me about this eight of wands in the reverse. Why is that here? The page of cups. So they're trying to communicate with you. They could be trying to tell you how they feel or trying to, or, you know, trying to apologize to you. And I feel like uh, either you're not receiving their message or you're not like you're not responding to their message. They're not able to talk to you here. It's driving them nuts. Tell me about this nine of swords, the three of pentacles. They want to start things back up and, you know, they're upset because they can't talk to you. They feel like you guys could get past this. They feel like you guys do want the same things now. And they do see, like, a lot of things are being put on display for this person. You know, and now they're seeing things in a different light. And it's like, well, now that I'm seeing this and now that I'm ready, um, you know, they won't talk to me. Capricorn won't talk to me. Tell me about this strength card in the reverse. We got the five of swords. So looking back at the past, they keep looking back at you and they're kind of like, you know, like I said, I don't feel like they want you to be, they're not like, oh, I wish that they were miserable, but they want to know that you're affected by this too. They want to know that you're having a hard time too. Tell me about this Knight of Swords in the reverse. We got the Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like you guys have made, it's like you guys are standing your ground. I feel like you guys have made a decision, you know, not to communicate with this person. And it's very, you know, they don't know how to handle it. They're not handling it well at all. Tell me about, and maybe it's, you also don't trust yourself to communicate with this person. It's like you don't even want to open yourself back up to that. Tell me about this full card in the reverse. We have the sun card. 
Yeah, I feel like this person, like I said, I feel like they're they're seeing a lot that they didn't see before. They're realizing a lot that they didn't before. They are seeing you as their happiness, and that's why they're getting so anxious um, that, you know, things are not going to go the way that they want them to go here. Tell me about this Four of Pentacles. You got the hangman in the reverse. So, you know, they're still really holding on, and you're releasing them here. And the Seven of Cups, they don't know what to do about it. Four of Cups in the reverse. You know, they want you to open back up to them here. And I feel like you're not sure what you want to do for some of you either. It's a lot of energy. You know, I do. I feel like this person has really hurt you in the past. And that's why you're so hesitant to open back up to this. And I feel like there's a part of you that wants to believe this person. But there's a bigger part of you that doesn't. And this person, I do feel like they are realizing some things. Um... But it's up to you to decide whether that's, you know, too little, too late. But that is what I have for you, Capricorn. Now, if this resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, check out your other placements. Everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading, personals, Patreon, the tarot course, all of that stuff is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, you guys can just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys for being here and for supporting me and I will see you soon.